we got everything wrong about IQ. Actually, this is the truth. May people say that, oh, he has a high IQ, so he will be successful in life. Or he has low IQ, he will be not successful in life. And we tend to make predictions based on IQ. It's like we are considering IQ as a permanent thing that we can't change and it's like a fixed at birth. There's a person called Alfred Binet. He's actually a Frenchman. He was the one who invented IQ, intelligent quotient, the test. So I will tell you the story behind it. It was in early 20th century in Paris public schools. He made a test to see how people performed on a test. And later, he wanted to see how the education system is helping them to become more learnable. He wanted to see how they got improved. So he devised something called IQ test to see how they got improved. Okay, And that's how he invented the IQ test to see how they got improved. He has a very famous book called Modern Ideas About Children. He wrote that book and in that book, if you see that, you would be shocked. We consider IQ as permanent and do you know what the founder, the creator, the inventor of IQ thought, he said that intelligence is not fixed at all. He said we need to protest and we have to fight against the people and the system that thinks that this is the reality that intelligence is fixed. He said that with practice, enough practice and training, everyone can become intelligent. He literally wrote that. See, the person who invented IQ does not have a problem with IQ. Then why we are thinking IQ as permanent thing? Even Carol Estweck, the author of mindset she's a very famous psychologist and she also proved that again and again that intelligence is not fixed with enough training we can hone the skills and become intelligent finally you can be relaxed knowing that iq is not fixed iq does not decide your future so be free and if someone says that you are not intelligent just say that i will practice more and i will find the ways so that i can become intelligent so to say subscribe uh, uh. yeah thank you <laughs>